Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Merhaba arkadaşlar, bizim YouTube kanalımıza hoş geldiniz. So today we are doing a video which is a continuation of the previous video where we discussed the differences between now and anymore. Today we'd actually be looking at anymore and no longer. Arkadaşlar, bir önceki videonun devamına başlayacağız. Yani bir önceki videoda now ver anymore arasındaki farklılıktan bahsetmiştik. Bugün anymore ve no longer dan bahsedeceğiz. So guys, if you haven't checked out the previous video, be sure to check that out before continuing. Arkadaşlar, bir önceki videoyu izlememiş olursanız mutlaka onu izleyin. So let's begin. Anymore and no longer. These two words are actually very close to each other in English language and they have the same meaning. This implies that they could be used in the same sentence, not at the same time, but they could be used in the same sentence. Arkadaşlar, bu iki kelime birbirine yakın olan kelimelerdir ve aynı anlama gelen kelimeler. For example, we don't play football anymore. This particular sentence, we could decide to write it in a different way using a different set of words. We have, we no longer play football anymore. Akadashla bu birinci oneyimize bakalım. Artık futbol oynamıyoruz. Bu birinci cümleyi başka bir şekilde kurmaya kalksak. We no longer play football kurabiliriz. Yani başka kelime kullandık biz. Dediğim gibi yukarıda verdiğimiz kelimeler aynı anlama gelen kelimelerdir. So guys, this is a very important point I want us to note that no longer is used right after the subject of the sentence. That is before the verb. Whereas anymore is always used at the end of the sentence. What does this imply? This lets us understand that when you use no longer, it must be after the subject of the sentence and before the verb of the sentence and no and anymore should be used at the end of the sentence. Akadashlar bu üzerinde durmamız gereken bir nokta yani no longer nerede kullanabiliriz no longer cümlenin oznesinden sonra hemen kullanabiliriz ya da cümlenin fiilinden önce kullanabiliriz ve anymore cümlenin sonunda kullanabiliriz yani sadece ve sadece cümlenin sonunda kullanılabilen bir kelimedir We'll be explaining all of this with examples. Arkadaşlar, bunları hep örneklerle anlatacağız sizlere. The first example there, I no longer go to school. We can see the positioning of no longer. No longer comes immediately after the subject of the sentence and just before the verb of the sentence go. We take a look at the following sentence there. I don't go to school anymore. Where was any more used? As we can see, it was used at the very end of the sentence, not at any other position. Let's be careful with this. Akadashlar, gordunuz gibi no longer nerede kullanıldı? Cümlenin tam uznesinden sonra kullanıldı ve cümlenin fiilinden önce kullanıldı. Yani başka yerde kullanılamaz. İkincisine geçelim. I don't go to school anymore. Anymore, sadece ve sadece cümlenin sonunda kullanıldı. Yani başka yerde kullanılmış olsaydı yanlış olurdu. The second set of sentences, we don't talk anymore. We can see that anymore was used at the very end of the sentence. It cannot be used at any other position in the sentence. We no longer talk. As we can see, no longer was used after the subject of the sentence and before the verb of the sentence. Akadashlar, gordumuz gibi burada anymore sadece ve sadece cümlenin sonunda kullanıldı ve no longer cümlenin oznesinden sonra ve cümlenin fiilinden önce kullanıldı. We have the third example there. As we can see, it's the same thing. He doesn't eat anymore anymore at the end of the sentence, he no longer eats meat. Akadashlar burada 
help an attain gibi any more near the colonial day they no longer near the colonial day and we have an important note down there no more can also be used in place of any longer meaning from the above sentences wherever you have any longer you could replace it with no more akadashlar bu bashka kulan lejemis bir kelimedir yani no longer yerine no more kulanabiliriz hep yukarıda sizlere verdim cümlelerde cümlelerde so let's look at some common mistakes when it comes to the usage of any more and no longer akadashlar genel yapılan hata lara bakacağız anymore ve no longer kullanıl de zaman the first example there anymore i drink coffee we can see anymore was not used at the beginning of the sentence that at the end of the sentence that is why it's an incorrect sentence akadashlar burda anymore cümlenin başında kullanıldığı için cümle tamamen yanlıştır we have the second sentence there anymore i am 20 years old i am 20 this is we if we take a look at the positioning of anymore it is at the beginning of the sentence that is why it is incorrect agarashla shuna ije bakalım anymore jumlenin başında olduğu için cümle yanlıştır the third example there she smokes no longer actually here we can see no longer was used after the verb of the sentence so it's an incorrect sentence agarashla burda no longer cümlenin fiilinden sonra kullanıldığı için kurduğumuz cümle yanlıştır. The next example we have no longer and any more used at the same time. This creates what we call a redundant sentence. You have to choose either any more or no longer. Arkadaşlar burada hata nereden kaynaklanıyor? No longer ver any more. Aynı cümle Aynı zamanda kullanıldığı için cümle yanlıştır. Yani bir tanesini seçmek zorundayız. Anymore I can speak English, the positioning causes the error in the sentence. Okay? So what would actually like you guys to do for this sentence we sentences we've given above would like you to write the correct form of these sentences in the comment box. Arkadaşlar bu yukarıdaki verilen hatalı cümlelerin doğrusunu yazmanızı istiyoruz. Thank you guys for watching. Arkadaşlar izlediğiniz için çok teşekkür ediyoruz. Please like and share this video. Leave comments and subscribe to our channel. And please don't forget to press the bell icon.